All right, boys and girls, and welcome to Gordon Guitar. We have Hosier here, uh, and they were here with us a couple of days ago. Now back with First Lights. All right, so this is a great song here. We have a couple of chords, and please straight strumming there we'll use for this. It works pretty much through the entire song. So let's dive into this one, First Light by Hosier. All right, so we'll go through the chords first. They are seven, I believe. So let's start with the first one and go with B minor. That's a bar chord. You place a bar here on the second fret and you bar all strings except for the last E here in the bass. So five strings from bottom up. Then the rest will be fourth on D, fourth on G, and third on B. We have even the B here, so you need to adjust your fingers a little bit to get that one. If you don't go with a lazy double bar there, I will show you how it's done. Like you really have to hold here if you want to stick with the exact notes there. So you still keep the bar there on the second fret over the same strings, five strings from bottom up. And then the rest you need to add is fourth on D, fourth on G and fourth on B. And like I said, you can just put a bar there on the fourth fret as well. And then try to uh, stay away with the last E there when it comes to your strumming there with the strumming hand. So then stick with the mid strings there if you go with the double bar like this. Otherwise, this is how B looks like. So B minor and B so far. Let's uh, continue with the bars and get that over with. So we'll go with the F sharp now. Um, and um, that is a bar here placed on the second fret still now over all strings. And then the rest you need to add is fourth on A, fourth on D, and third on G. All right, so now we will move on to D. And that is uh, actually D major seven, sorry, like this. So what you do here, you're going to play the open D and then you place a bar on the second fret and you bar the last three strings, the G, B and the E string on the second fret, just like that. You get the D major seven. All right. Next is the G. So that is third on E, second on A, open D, open G, third B and third E. Minor next, so that is open E, second A, second D, open G, open B, and open E. And finally, we have the A. So that is open A, second D, second G, second B, and open E. All right, so before we look into the parts and how to play which chords and all that, we need to learn this drawing pattern. And you can go with two ways here. I showed you one of them here in the introduction of this tutorial. And if we grab the B minor, since that is the first chord, we have this one, which I prefer, the down, 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 up. Okay, so down, 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 down. So you play two downs first, and I prefer to play them on the bass strings up here. Okay, and then you go down and play the down, down, up. And play it a little bit more down here with the higher notes, the top strings. And um, the first down of this down, down, up uh, is really important to highlight in some way. I use a little bit more strength to it and get a real down there and try to get that one. And you can also replace this with a clap instead. And if you do that, then it will follow more the rhythm of this song. And then it will sound like this. Down, down, clap, down, up. So. Okay, that works as well. But I prefer the down instead with a little more emphasis and it sounds like this. A couple rounds of it will be. So we're ready for this actual song and we'll start with the verse. You're going to play B minor 4, the D major 7, 4, G4 and E minor 4. 
Then on the next round, you play B minor 4, the D major 7th 4, then the G4, and back to the D4. Okay, so it's very similar, just the D instead of the E minor in the second round. Still just four strong rounds per core there. And then you will end with one down on the F sharp there and a pause that follows. Okay, uh, so that is the first verse. And then we'll go to the pre chorus there. You're gonna continue the same strumming here. You're gonna play G2, then the D2, and B4. You play that for two rounds, so again, G2, D2, and B4. And then you're gonna play one down on the D with a pause, and then one down on A with a pause, okay? So that is the pre-chorus. And uh, then we will turn into the chorus here. So the first chorus will be B4, G2, D2, and then B4, okay. So that ends the first chorus. And uh, then we'll go for the second round here. It's very much like the first round. The first and second verse are exactly the same. All the difference there is the last D there in the second round, the B minor D, G, and D. Instead of playing four rounds on all that last uh, D there, you only play two stronger rounds of that one. Everything else is the same. So that takes us to the second pre-chorus, and it's exactly the same as the first one, so nothing changes there. And then the second chorus, we have the B four strong rounds, G two strong rounds, and the D two strong rounds. This three chord uh, combo there, uh, you will play that for five rounds in the end. And that pretty much sums it up for Hosier's first light. I showed how to play everything, all of these parts here in the introduction of this tutorial here. So if you're not certain of how it sounds or how it, uh, it's done, then watch the intro of this tutorial and you will see. So I hope you enjoyed this. And if you did, please thumb up this tutorial. And until next time, guys, play tuned.